Hi everyone, my name is Ryan, I'm a presenter from Scizic. Now, a little bit about me, I absolutely love looking at stars at night. People all around the world, from many generations, have looked up at the stars, and many cultures have their own interpretations of the stars. You can find constellations, which are dot-to-dot -dot pictures made by groups of stars, from cultures all around the world. Today, we're going to show you a little activity as to how you can bring constellations into your own home. Let's check it out. What you're going to need is some small scraps of paper, a pen, some lucky bears, a cardboard roll, and a torch. Now that we have all our equipment ready, we need to choose one constellation to do this activity with first. But what are constellations used for? Constellations for many generations have been used for many things, such as storytelling, navigating, mapping, even telling the time. There's so many different uses. Since so many different cultures and generations have made constellations, it's probably good to do a bit of research first. Now that you've chosen your constellation, you're ready to begin. I've decided to choose Orion to show you how to do our activity. What you need to do is take your little cover roll and a piece of paper, like so, and trace the bottom of it onto your paper. Now, what you need to do next is draw your constellation inside that circle. And there we have it. I've now done a drawing of Orion inside our circle, making sure the stars or the points in the page are nice and big so I can see them. What we're going to do next are punch holes where those stars are straight through the paper. It's easy to do this. If you go back over the top of your cardboard roll, like so, and very carefully use your pen, just the tip of the pen, to puncture the paper. And then what we're going to do, we're going to put a lucky band over the top so that your piece of paper stays there. We're going to find something to start. We're going to get our torch, shine it through the cup of rock, and find out what happens. We're going to turn on our torch. And we're going to shine it. And voila, we have made our very own at-home constellation.